Welcome to UITM Clinical Skills Program. This is Clinical Station 8, Nasogastric Tube Insertion. In this video, you will learn the technique of inserting a nasogastric tube using a mannequin instead of a real patient for learning purposes. Before you begin, please ensure that your hands are clean and gloved. Obtain an appropriately sized nasogastric tube. Please refer to your reading materials for more information on this. The patient should be positioned with the neck straight, either in supinar sitting position. First, measure the desired length of the nasogastric tube to be inserted. Measure from the nose to the tragus of the ear, then down to 5 cm below the zephysternum. After measuring, do take note of the length and remember the measurement that you have obtained as you prepare to insert the nasogastric tube. Before insertion, lubricate the tip of the nasogastric tube, either with lignocaine spray or gel. If available, a local anesthetic spray can be used on the back of the throat. Insert the tube through a nostril. Gently advance the nasogastric tube through the nasopharynx. This is often the most uncomfortable part for the patient. If you feel resistance, gently rotating the tube can help. However, do not try to force the tube in. If the patient becomes distressed or is gagging, pause and allow the patient to relax first before proceeding. It's useful to look inside the patient's mouth intermittently to ensure that the nasogastric tube isn't coiling in there. If the patient is cooperative, ask the patient to swallow as you advance the tube. This can help facilitate the insertion of the tube. Advance the nasogastric tube until you see the marking or measurement that you have obtained earlier on at the, the edge of the nostril. In this mannequin, you can see the tip of the nasogastric tube as it advances into the gastric cavity. Normally, you would not see this in a life patient. To check tube placement, first, attach a syringe to the port of the nasogastric tube. Then, attempt to syringe out the gastric content. Next, remove the syringe from the port and aspirate some air into your syringe before placing the syringe back at the tube port. Then, place your stethoscope diaphragm at the gastric area or at the stomach region in a real patient. Once done, push the air from the syringe into the tube rapidly as you listen through your stethoscope. If the tube is placed correctly, you should be able to hear a pop. As the gush of air goes through the tube into the stomach. Once the placement is assessed to be correct, secure the nasogastric tube to the nostril with plasters. In this video, you have learned the technique of inserting a nasogastric tube. At the end of the procedure, help to clean the patient's face and nose with paper towels. Dispose of used equipment, including gloves into a clinical waste bin and wash your hands. To supplement your learning, please go to our CSL platform to download materials related to this station. You are also encouraged to view this video again in our CSL platform to help you with your practice sessions.